The last of today's hurdle races is the three miler. And the top one is Bell Kinnan for Alex Cherry. Profits Passion for David Hooley. Stadium Arcadium Craig Allen. Jinka Trail Martin and Benny and Bjorn. And Give Me a Copper for Graham Clutterbuck. Fresno Mellington and Orlando Template for Vinnie Gerard. Luxembourg Darren Thompson. Raj Negara Prism for David Robertson. Such a Creep for Craig Allen. Crystal Empire for Leon van Rensburg who's also got Hidden Persuader. And Ravati Megan for Martin Lidham and Chapter Blend. For Ryan Costello, 15 again then. And calling and ready to go in the watery Welsh sunshine as they make their way towards the first of the flights of hurdles in this. And it's Give Me a Copper on the inside at Orlando Template, closest to us, who are disputing the lead early on, although they're separating virtually by the width of their track as they get to the first. And it's 13 flights to take in all this time, and they've already successfully negotiated the first of them. And I'm sure. Vinnie Gerard will be hoping Orlando Template cuts across to the inside before too long. At the moment, give me a copper. It is clear on the rail. With Orlando Template second, and a gap of about five lengths, then back to Bell Kinnan, who's third, another one who was around last season. Luxembourg the Grays in fourth, then Chapter Blend is after that one, with Amravati Megan on the rail. And towards the back, Hidden Persuader is out the back, and we've seen quite a few of Leon Van Rensburg's horses be. Horses that are running from the back today. Most of them have run through pretty well towards the end though. And give me a coppers in the lead and Orlando Template has indeed tucked across now to join him. And those two have settled down five lengths clear of Bell Kinnan, Luxembourg and Imravati Megan. who are disputing third. As they make their way towards the second, it was a long old run to that second flight wasn't it? But they're all safely to the other side of it and give me a copper. Continues to lead. From Orlando Template. A gap of four lengths then back to Bell Kennan is a clear third now as they take flight three. And they're all safely over that one. The Grey Luxembourg is fourth, the only grey in this one, I think. And then comes Amravati Megan on that one's inside, just almost totally obscured at this point as they take flight number four. And towards the back, Benny and Bjorn have now dropped towards the back. So whether the jockey's gonna manage to get a tune out of those two. I don't know, but at the moment he's not doing it. And it's Give Me a Copper who's in the lead. So Give Me a Copper then, clear by two. As they get over number five and jump that one much quicker than Orlando Template, who's now dropped back to three lengths behind him. And is only a couple of lengths in front of Bell Kennan now. Fresno Mennington has moved through into fourth. Luxembourg is just tucked in behind that one. Stadium Arcadium is getting a bit closer as well. As they pass the winning post then with a complete circuit to go. And Give Me a Copper leads by two lengths to Orlando Template who's going well again now in second, gap back to Bell Kinnan third, then another gap to Fresno Mellington and Luxembourg and then Stadium Arcadium and Ravati Megan's on the inside of Raj Nagara Prism and Chapter Blend is after that one then comes Such a Creep who's with Profits Persuasion and Hidden Persuader and Jinka Trail towards the back with Crystal Empire and finally Benny and Bjorn up the back of the pack so give me a copper in front then and Benny and Bjorn last it's a race being topped and tailed by Graham Clutterbuck at the moment then with give me a copper in front by half a length to Orlando Template who's travelling nicely in second Bell Kennan is back in third as they make their way towards flight number six and over that one they go and again give me a copper out jumping Orlando Template Bell Kennan back in third stadium Arcadium is just about showing fourth now as they get over Number seven, good jump there by the Grey Luxembourg, who's back in about sixth place, but one or two of these in that little group behind him now, starting to inch a little bit closer and thinking about making their move. Will this leading pair stay where they are or will they come back to the pack? It's Give Me a Copper and Orlando Template. They appear to be going well enough at the moment, but there's still more than a mile to go and Give Me a Copper leads by Nick to Orlando Template in second, who's got five lengths on Bell Kennan and Stadium Arcadium, and then Fresno Mellington, and then Luxembourg is running a nice quiet race on the inside as they get over number nine. Good jump there by uh, such a creep as well who's now getting a little bit closer also Hidden Persuader is starting to move its way through the pack Amravati Megan's lost her place though Benny and Bjorn is starting to creep through as well 
Crystal Empire hasn't got going at all yet and Jinker Trail has been out the back most of the way and Chapter Blend is now the complete back marker but it's Orlando Template who's in the lead now on the outside just from Give Me A Copper who's probably going to regain the lead on this turn as they begin to sweep now into this long straight and it's Give Me A Copper and Orlando Template they're three or four clear of Bell Kennan such a creep and Stadium Arcadium are getting closer then comes Luxembourg and Rangara Prism hidden persuaders after that one then Fresno Mennington trying to get closer Profits Passions trying to run on as well difficult to see anything else winning from there but they're racing down towards now the final four and a half furlongs they've still got four flights of hurdles to take and it's Give Me A Copper in the lead from Orlando Template Bell Kennan here comes Profits Passion over the fourth last they go it's still Give Me A Copper in front Give Me A Copper by a neck but Profits Passion is bursting up the centre of the track and has suddenly hit the front Profits Passion's in the lead Hidden Persuaders after him in hot pursuit as they get to the third last over that one they go it's Profits Passion but here comes Hidden Persuader also such a creepy starting to run on there's still two more flights to take it's Profits Passion by about a length to Hidden Persuader in second over the second last they go Profits Passion jumped it better got away from it better he's now too clear racing down towards his final flight Profits Passion looking like he's probably only got to jump it he's two lengths clear of Hidden Persuader in second Bell Kennan sticking on in third down towards his final flight and Hidden Persuader's coming back and jumped it better and Hidden Persuader moves alongside and Hidden Persuader takes it up Profits Passion's got nothing left and Hidden Persuader is racing towards the line it's going to be another one for Leon Van Rensburg and Hidden Persuader takes it Profits Passion is second running on well in third Orlando Template then Bell Kennan and Stadium Arcadium and all the way back to Chapter Blend and once again the horse takes the final obstacle looking like it's got the race sewn up only to be totally swamped by Leon Van Rensburg fast finisher and hidden persuader has taken it Profits Passion looked all over the winner at one point so hidden persuader the winner then for Leon Van Rensburg Profits Passion for David Hooley second Orlando Template for Vinnie Gerard third Bell Kinnan for Alex Cherry ran a good race in fourth Stadium Arcadium for Craig Allen was fifth and one or two of those looked like they were in with chances didn't really get a blow in horses like Luxembourg and Raj Nagara Prism and such a creep looked to be going really well but never really got involved in the business end of the race.